Uh, my name is Stefan Allaire. I'm in charge of uh, Winnovation, the CEO of Winnovation. Winnovation is a Brick Telecom subsidiary. In, we just start in uh, January 2013, but uh, I'm in the Silicon Valley. I was in charge of the US office from Brick Telecom for five years. Brick Telecom is a carrier in France. It's a sub carrier. It's uh, like AT&T or Verizon. So. It's, but the Bouygues Telecom belongs to the Bouygues groups, a very big group, it's about 140,000 people in all over the world, in 80 countries. And we start with the construction, with the building, and after the roads, and after the television with TF1, and uh, the telecom with Bouygues Telecom. The goal is very easy, we try to find innovation for the groups. So what we are looking, we are looking, we are a matchmaker. So we find innovation, we find good startup, new technology, new services, and we bring back to France and say, we should use this for our customer to make the difference in the French market. And we put in relation people from France and from US. We are two people. So we try to be very, very efficient. efficient and uh, only two people. And we try to be commercial because when we met startup, uh, we also need to sell wigs. Because for the US startup, wigs is perhaps a big group in France, but it is not well known. And I help us because I say, you know, you have an opportunity to go in the French market and to go very fast. As we are a smaller company like Verizon or AT&T, we can go very fast. And what's happened? In, uh, we make about three contracts a year. And uh, we don't make any investment. And I think it's good for us because uh, when I push um, a company inside Bouygues, Bouygues Telecom or a TF1, it's because I trust in this company, I trust in this technology. It's not because I put money on it. I think it's, it's more easy for my job. Um, it's why we, we try to be more efficient with this company and it's why the relation is very clear with the company. At the beginning we say, we will not make any money, we, we will not put money. But after people sign a contract. And I explained to the startup, you know, when we start working together, I will be your best commercial inside with Telecom. Because if I trust in your solution, uh, I will help you to find a good contact because if, even if we are a smaller group, we have a big group. For example, in Bouygues Telecom, there is 9,000 people. So you need to have someone help you to find a good contact and uh, to see how you can sell the product and uh, what type of solution. But we are a filter also because when I met more than 400 startups in one year, I will not push all the startups inside Bouygues Telecom. Uh, so I don't want to make dreams everyone, uh, but we are a filter and when we trust and we believe in someone or in some technology, we push this technology inside. We are looking for disruptive technology, disruptive services. Um, for example, I can give you some examples because in five years we signed more than 15 contracts. Uh, for example, we signed with Azurion in the insurance. We signed with people in the IT with violin memory in the Silicon Valley. We sign with people like Touch Commerce in Los Angeles when they can help us on the website. So it's all the parts of the Bui Telecom. So it could be on the network, it could be on the IT, it could be on the how to be more efficient with the self-care, how to be efficient with the customer care, how to be more efficient with the website. So all the technology that can help us to improve our relation with the customer and our efficiency on the French market. We are looking for company more just not at the beginning. We are looking for some people who have already some uh, references. If they already worked with Verizon, AT&T, it's a good thing for a good side for us. Because we're not looking for just an idea. We are looking for something we can already use in France. What are the big, um, big, big trends in the France for the next year will be the 4G. So we are really looking for 4G net solution. So how we will have the 4G network. How could we prove to the customer what the 4G will bring to them? which type of application will use our network. So we really are looking at how to be more efficient with the customer with the 4G. We are looking for mobile apps on the 4G side, we are looking for video for the 4G side, because I'm sure that the best way to demonstrate the 4G capabilities will be the video. So we are looking for some videos and some uh, application we can prove to the customer, yes, you have a 4G, is great. With BNU, the Big Telecom offer, we have a BNU. It's a no contract, SIM only solution, so no device subsidy. Uh, it's 20 euros per month. It's 19.99 to be exact. Uh, 
for net for 20 years a month you have unlimited voice unlimited data and unlimited text so it's very very cheap if you compare to it and it's taxes included because in US even if you have uh, something a plan for 50 euros you need to add the taxes so in France no taxes uh, the competition, how I can explain the competition is for us very very hard. Um, we have a new carrier named Free, just arrived on the French market and they break the market and they, they cut the price. And they, they cut the price also because they don't subsidize the mobile. Um, we have another similar offer, but for this offer to, be, to reach this type of price, uh, you have no stores. You have no, no customer care, no device subsidy, and you try to be very, very efficient. Um, I think that's a trend you will arrive in US. You will you see with T-Mobile this week, uh, with also with Walmart, they offer with trade talks, they 45 euros, 45 dollars per month, and I'm sure that uh, in the next month or weeks we will see some offer from some other carriers in the US about no contract SIM only solution. In the US, for example, you need to deploy the 4G network. And to put the antenna, to have all the engineers making this working perfectly, it's costly. So there's a competition, but uh, at the end, you cannot risk low, low price because at the end, your service will be declined also. So you will have not a good service, you will not have a good coverage. So if you want, there's a big competition because people bundle the wireline with the wireless. So you get, for example, you get for around 60 euros, you can get unlimited data with your wireless phone, unlimited call, unlimited um, text, but also television at home, internet at home, and wireline phone. So you can have a nice bundle with very, very aggressive price. And it's not, it's not yet the case in the US, but I think it will arrive. You've seen the opportunity with Comcast and uh, um, Verizon. You get a Verizon plan, you have a reduction for your Comcast plan. And uh, there is some, I think we will arrive with some bundle with, for example, AT&T with Uverse. I'm sure that in a one, two or three years, they will make some bundle when you can, you go in the family with a Uverse plan, but if you take a wireless plan with us, you will have a reduction. It's, a, it's already the case, but I think it will, give, it will go more and more deeper. And it's what we've seen in France. For example, mm -hmm. in France, when you take a plan, uh, you take a bandwidth for your wireline. And you get the bandwidth. If it's 20 megabytes, if it's 10 megabytes, you pay the same price. In US, it's better because they educate the people. If you consume only 20 megabytes or you want to get 50 megabytes, you need to add an options. And that's different from the French market. And it's why it happened, for example, for the wireless plan. In France, where to take a plan, everything is included. And you go in, I, I was surprised when I start in the US five years ago, I go, I've seen a nice price. I go in the AT&T store and I say, wow, that's a nice price. But I say, oh, you get an iPhone, you need to add this. You want some text, you need to add this. And the end, the final price was not the, <laughs> the price I was coming, I, I had at the beginning, so I was surprising. And after you need to add the tax also. So you have an appeal price, but the price you pay at the end is not the same. What's the best way for a startup to get in touch with Winnovation? They can send us an email, sa at winnovation.net, like Stefan Allaire, and I think you can give the, the link, and it's a good way. So you send me an email and uh, we keep in touch. Thank you.